What's good YouTube, your boy Danny Mac coming to you for another video. So this time I'm just doing a, a quick update on my team actually because some, some of my um, subscribers been wanting just to see what my team looks like because I haven't really been doing any streaming and haven't been doing any videos specifically showing what the team looks like basically I guess. So just a quick update here um, in terms of, oh you can't, so what am I for? Okay, my bad, man. So in terms of my cards collected, I'm up to 3673. I, I didn't really think I was going to try to go for 4000 up until about a couple of weeks ago. I had like 2400 and I had like a million MT and I was like, you know what, maybe I should try to collect cards or whatever. So why not? You know what I'm saying? It's kind of part of the game. I have enjoyed it in the past. I think one year I did actually collect enough cards and it's not as easy being no money spent or whatever, but I do play the game a decent amount. Um, so yeah, so I'm at the 3673, but pretty much all the cards that are left are just expensive, you know, minimum, you know, 10,000 or more MT, so yeah, nowhere near 4,000, but we still got over three months to go, so I think I will be able to do it by the time before 2K23 comes out, you know, so that's the journey, we will see, we will, we will definitely see if I get there or not, um, so right now the limited lineup I've been using this weekend so far... No, this is one. So I had put, I had did a video with the Pelicans. I used them. I didn't use them though. Then I decided to go ahead and try a different one. So because it's, you can use any team. It's thirty teams. So yeah, whatever team you think is good. Um, so I've been using this Cavaliers lineup. I'm like I think four and two. So you know, like I, I think one guy beat me like twelve to two, and I just was like, eh, okay, just. You know, he got me. You know, if it was like unlimited, I, I think our team was good enough to make a comeback and stuff. But in limited, eh, you know, you, you get down a little bit, you be like, yeah, all right, I just go to the next game. There's no penalties for quitting or whatever anymore. So, you know, sometimes just quit and go to the next game. So, haven't won the ring yet, but I would definitely get to it. But this has been my team here. Garland, Porter, Seti, Danny Ferry, and Evan Mobley. I got Ferry out of a pack, so luckily there. All right. And so, and then I guess my main team... Or I don't even call it my main team because I when I play unlimited right now my unlimited team is this one and that may change you know I change it you know whenever I if I start losing a little I change it but every every season I was able to get the the, the prize and then I was able to also do the lockdown like three seasons in a row I didn't even go for the prize last season um, yeah I didn't go for it so I, I got to pink diamond I was just like yeah that's an, or yeah I think pink diamond I was like that's enough I didn't really I wasn't just wasn't into it. So I didn't do it. So I, I run a five-man lineup, and then I just got – so right now I got uh, Vitas Sabonis, Jonathan Isaac, Anthony Davis. So it's an 86-rated team, so it's a pretty good value team. So I don't play with my best team. I'm I'm not great with great players as other people are with great players because I don't dribble well and all that. So I don't need a great team. I try to I'm – not, I'm not – like I said, I'm not as good with the great, great players as other people are. So the main goal of my team is to win for me, and I guess that's what I think should be for you. So – you gotta find you. A lot of people I talk to that are just you know I chat with online or whatever. Some a lot of people don't even play online at all. They don't like to play online because of the, the pressure, the stress of it. But you can just I mean you just gotta kind of find your niche, find five good players you play with. Because sometimes you will get easy games just from doing it. And early on, you're basically so especially early on, you only gotta win. You know, so in the first season, you only gotta win. You can lose. You only got to win two games. You could lose 14 games and still get to the next level. Then the next level, you got to win three games and five games. So you have a lot of losses you can – nobody likes to lose. But I'm saying if you're losing, you can quit and go in the early – at least in the early levels, it doesn't take a long time to get your prize. Once you get to like pink diamond, I think it's like 10 out of 16. And then di or whatever. Or diamond like 10 out of 16 or something. Pink diamond is like 12 or whatever. Diamond's 9 out of 16. So you can go 9 and 7 and still get the prize. Pink down, I think I go 10 and 6. And then guys, he'll be 12 and 4. So, you know, as you get, if if, it, if the stress gets to you a little or you don't, I hate if you don't like losing. I don't like losing either, but go to the next game. That's all. That's what, if you got the time. So that's all I'm saying. Um, I, in other words, Unlimited ain't as scary as it used to be. Like, you know, because you don't have to go 12 and 0 or whatever. So find you a good team. And like I said, some games you'll just get lucky. You'll have a better team than the other guy. And, you know, and, yeah, and you can get them to quit sometime pretty early. Some people, I've been seeing guys, well, I got some guys who won't quit. They'll be down 60 and still playing. So, you know, it is what it is. But a lot of times my, I go through Unlimited decently fast when I want to, when I can get some good games on a good roll or whatever. Um, and so what we see here, so, okay, violence management. 
I go all the bad babbling and stuff. So this is kind of, I mean, this is, like I said, this is, I got it. These are my team. These are the, the guys I've gotten. So I've gotten, most of them are, also, most of my best players are reward players. You know, I barely ever pay for the, because um, I just, I don't know, just, there's always going to be another great player. And it's like, don't want to spend my MT. As long as I'm winning enough on, with these players, I'm, I'm happy. So I got Josh Giddy, Richard Jefferson, Paul George, Antoine Jameson, Al Horford. And I'm saying this is like, like I said, I don't even play with this kind of lineup. So, but these are just, I'm just was showing you what I got. Then you got, I, I love this Oscar Robinson card we just got. Uh, I just got Matt Calvin, Ray Allen, Marcus Johnson, Vince Carter, Macau Bridges, Jimmy Butler, Dikembe. Some other players that are Dark Matters, Gary Payton, Joe Dumars, Bill Lambeer, Thurl Bailey, Carl Malone, Trey, Marcus, Bradley Beal, Jalen Brunson, John Morant, Jerry Sloan, Jordan Poole, Spencer Dinwiddie. Markel Fultz and Alex English. And like I said, if it was, you know, so they then got a lot of Galaxy Opals. Um, the, you know, not not too expensive. Wood. I think I paid a grip for David Robson. I love David Robson cards. So I think I paid like 70000 when he first came out. He's probably only for like 20000 now. But, you know, I, 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 every now and then I will splurge on a pretty good player that I that I actually really like. This Danny Ferry card, I may sell him back after I would do limited. Last time I looked, I think I looked yesterday, he's still worth around 30000 So I may... I may sell them back or something, but I, I do like the card a lot. Um, Sean Marion, Looney. So this is just just giving you an idea of some of the cards that I, I have picked up or whatever. So like I said, I'm, I'm I play with like I said the Anthony Davis card a lot. Yeah. So yeah. So that's it. I, I, I just wanted to keep, like I said, I, I, a couple of my guys want to see what my team looks like and stuff. I think I throw in a few tidbits if I could or whatever. But and it's, yeah. So don't be scared of them. Um, don't you don't have to be scared of online. It ain't. It it, it isn't. You know. It isn't, um, you, you got to play with who you like to play. It don't, it don't always matter. And like I said, once you, what you'll find out, I know a lot of you don't have the time to play as much as I do. I hear you. But one thing about Unlimited, with the matchmaking, you will get, not always, you know, sometimes you will play against guys who are, you know, who have a much better team than you. Sometimes that does happen and stuff. But most of the time, I rarely play, when, since I play with a five-man team, I rarely play against um, guys who have like a five-man team that's much better than me. It's kind of... They'll have a, like a 90 rated team, but it'll be spread out over 10 or 12 players. And I usually five, and truth be told, five can beat 10 a lot of times. So, and then it also depends on your skill level. I'm a decent player. I'm, I'll probably put, put myself like a seven and a half out of 10. I'm not a great player by any stretch of the imagination. I dribble, to, no, my dribbling, I can't remember dribbling. Dribbling is just the, the basics of stuff. Anything, if I got to do more than one thing, I, 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 yeah, my brain just doesn't work that fast. But I still. When more than eighty percent of the games I play, part of that is the matchmaking. Part of that is you know I just do what I do, I guess. You know I have a, a lot of times I have a better team. Same thing with limit now like clutch time. Yeah, you go. It's going to be five on five, so you want to you know. So clutch time may be harder if you don't have a great team. It is because there there doesn't there, clutch time. There isn't really any matchmaking. It is really going to be um, you know their best five. The game is whoever's up next probably. You're going to play against them. So I do pretty good when I do play Clutch Time. I haven't played that much Clutch Time in a recent couple of months. Um, yeah, so it is what it is, y'all. All right, so I just kind of wanted to give you an update, man, and give you a few tidbits, you know, and I guess, like I say, the, 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 I, play, I play some, don't, you know, it's okay to lose. It's, it's okay to lose. Go to the next game. That's what you don't have to, don't worry about losing. You get what I'm saying? It's just a game. And you, once you remember that, you know, yeah, don't rage and, I get upset a little, but I don't, and I don't like to lose. But go to the next game. That's all, you know. That yeah, right, honey. Right. Do I? I do rage sometimes, don't huh? Yeah, you do. I get excited. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? That's my wife. You know, I get it. I love the. I'm a passionate dude. I love competing. So, I do. I do. Oh yeah, close games and get me mad. But I go to the next game, honey, don't I? Yeah. You yeah, do. I don't throw. I ain't never broken a controller. I don't break no TVs. I don't get crazy. But I am passionate, and it's okay to be passionate about the game. But, you know, just, like I said, go to the next, get another game, and you keep going, you keep going. The only way to get better at online playing is to play online. You can't, you know, that that's just a simple fact. you you got to learn what people do, learn their tendencies and all that. People play, people play this, not everybody plays the same, but most people play this. It's very similar, very similar. So, um, yeah, some people dribble really good, and some people, but some people dribble so good that they'll be by you and then they come back to you because they dribble so good. They don't, you know, they just, they love to dribble. Me, I'm trying to just get past you. So once I get past you, usually I'm gone. You know, if I do get lucky enough to get past you. And, um, yeah. So that's anyway, 
I, I keep rambling on and stuff. I meant for this to be a short video. God, there's been 10 minutes, honey. I'll be talking, huh? <laughs> but I'm excited. I love 2K, man. I love my team. I, you know what I'm saying? And I know more of you to play online. Cause I, I, said, I, I was shocked at how many people tell me they don't play it online at all. All they do is play offline. I'm like, wow, okay. And most times it's because they don't like to lose. They don't like the stress of it. And I get it. But like I said, the only way you get better at online is to play online. That's for sure. And hopefully my little tidbits will help out a little. All right. Peace and love, y'all. Thanks. Later.